You're right. There's bait out here. Oh my god, I got yes again! Yes! Big Jake. Can you can you get that gimbal for me please? Do it in my bucket. Just put it around me. No, no, put it on. Uh, uh, holy crap, that's a big fish. Is it a little bit tight? Thanks, man. Uh, oh. Oh. A big fish. Look at him pulling the boat, man. Huh? Look at him pulling the boat. Can you actually just lift this mode up in front of you, please? Then, so you put your foot on that, put your foot on the black grey thing, lift it up, twist it back this way. All right, turn it and turn it so it's on the side. Yep, yeah, pull it back. That's him. Keep pulling. There you go. All right, jump onto the motor, turn the key till the beeping stops, and then. There'll be a start button, can you press it? Next to it, quick. All right, put it just gently in gear. Uh, and just push this, go forward a bit. Just real gently, Let's just get the boat away from the rocks. Uh. Oh. Okay, turn hard this way now. Uh. I shouldn't have fucking done my back yesterday. Holy moly. Yeah, he's big. All right, can you put your gloves on? Put that glove on. Where are they? It should be where that glove is. The one I gave you. Yes, yeah, put it on. Yeah. All right, and then if he needs to go, he's gonna go. So wrap hard. Okay, hang on, hang on. Don't listen though. Just wait. Oh fuck. Okay, you go up a bit further. I'm gonna grab his tail. Yep. Oh god, there's GTs everywhere. Just turning this off so we can. All right, hang on. Just wait, swing him around if you can. All right, twist him now. All right, let's go, lift him in. 
find yourself. Oh, hello. That is a stud. Oh. Now that's how you open a GT account in the morning with that absolute stud. That is all day, 20 plus. What a fish. It almost crippled me. That was freaking awesome. All right, we're gonna see the fish, take some photos, let it go. But we're out, we decided to run to the reef. Didn't make it because the weather was a bit trash. Um, so we've just come to local islands. And I tell you what, right move. That was the result. Freaking awesome. Got Owen with me, got bait everywhere. We'll see to this fish and then we'll let it go. Here's a little remora. But yeah, that's freaking awesome. Now that is how you start a day. Absolute chunk of a G. Probably 20 kilos, I'd say. Massive, absolute wicked of a fish. Cannot believe it. This guy almost broke me. But we'll take the hooks out and um, we'll let him go. Don't really want to keep him out of the water for too long. Right in his fucking corner of his jaw. Oh, he's gonna bite me. There we go. All right, you rolling? Yeah, run the camera under the water. No, as, as, he go, as he goes in, all right. All right. Oh, shit. Oh. All right, there he is. Woo! How cool is that? Shouldn't have sworn, but that's awesome. We're gonna let him go. Here he goes, head first. Oh, he's good. He's off. Yeah, that, one that is how you start a day. How freaking awesome is that? Now, while there's not as much commotion going on, I'll just explain to you what we're doing. We decided to run out to the reef today, but with all the storms and everything around, it probably wasn't the best decision. So we decided to duck into one of our local islands. Oh, I gotta catch my breath. And that was the result. Probably popping for 20 minutes, hit it once, hit it again. And then he just absolutely crunched it. It's my biggest G in a while, probably 20 odd kilos. Really nice fish. But we gotta get Owen onto one. Last time he came out here, he lost a really, really nice one. So this time, he's gonna land one. We'll get at it. So we have an absolute feeding frenzy going on around us. We've seen bait just boiling up everywhere. Um, and there ten, well, there's pretty much hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of big eye trevally and um, bludger trevally. They're thick as, and they're feeding on this. So that's all the bait that they're feeding on. The bait obviously looks at the motor and thought, you know what, we can use that as protection. And the trevally are right behind the boat. I'm gonna put the camera in so you guys can see these fish. Thank you. 
Hopefully it's coming into the lines and moving around. Okay, it's coming into the lines. That turned out way cooler than I expected. Um, you actually saw them like, trying to come up and nibble the lens. But these little fish are terrified. They're being hunted in plague proportion by these here. That's so freaking cool. We've got another mass explosion going on over there where the birds are. But these fish won't eat out lures because they're feeding on such tiny, tiny little bait fish. Unless you match the hatch, you're never even going to get a look. So we might just leave these guys, unfortunately. Look at them over there. These guys are going to be someone's dinner. May seem pretty ruthless, but that's nature and that's the way it is. I think they're, um, I don't know what they are. They're so thick that you can actually put your hand in and almost grab them. Look at this. Look at them over my hand. See if we can come up very slowly to grab one. You can feel them. There's heaps there. Got one. Ah. Not sure what fish he is, but he's very small. I just don't want to keep him out of the wolf for too long. Just wanted to show you guys. We'll let him swim off now. There he goes with his mates. They all seem to be the same species. So if you guys know what they are, let me know because I've got zero idea what these fish are. I'll try and get a bigger one so we can sort of see what exactly they are.